If you're searching for ultimate in coins, head over to ifootcoins.com, hit up the link in the description below and use my discount code GUNA for 6% off. What's up guys, Gunnister here bringing you another Inform player review and today we are reviewing second Inform Alexis Sanchez. He has moved out to the left hand side for this second Inform. So guys remember 200 likes would be amazing, make sure you follow me on Twitter as well and there's a quick look at the team that I played him in. So when we look at him closer, we'll see he's 5 foot 7, high attacking, medium defensive work rates, right footed, 3 star weak foot and 4 star skill moves, I've added a dead eye chemistry style to him as well to boost his shooting and his passing as well. Sent me back just under 400k and he's played 7 games for me, got me 9 goals and 1 assist. So how's he compared to his regular card? Well you'll notice that he's changed position from right wing to left wing, he's gone up by 2 points overall, his pace has gone up by 2, his dribbling and physical by 4, passing by 5, defending by 6 and shooting the biggest increase going up by 7. And that's reflected in the stats right here. As you can see there the strength is only at 62 which isn't great but you look at the rest of it there's so much dark green on here. I mean 95 agility is a standout as well. Decent long shots that's a standout. Ball control near that finishing at 93, dribbling at 92 absolutely outstanding. There's so much dark green on there this card is absolutely stacked when it comes to the attacking side of things and you know what it's not a card that's going to let you down at all so have a look at that you know he weighs 136 pounds so he is lightweight and he's not the tallest guy either but then look how stacked he is dribbler acrobat clinical finisher and also the flare trait as well so what were my expectations of this second inform card well they were sky high because his first inform was an absolutely outstanding card to use i found it absolutely amazing to play with and one of the biggest things about that card was that it was a central card play at cam center forward striker and it was so versatile however now he's on the left hand side you know it's not as good news as being a central card however it's still better than being stuck out on the right hand side and of course because he's right foot it's so much easier to cut inside and bang it in on his stronger right foot so definitely the left handed side of things is definitely a benefit to this card however you know you've got to take that into account but the card itself is like if you look at it in its own right is absolutely outstanding now all the upgrades in the right areas he is stronger although for me he's still not strong enough and that is the one thing that does pay me a little bit about him but his shooting is better he's lightning quick even quicker than before better dribbling better curve better agility better balance everything about him just feels that so much better he's an absolutely outstanding card to use he will not let you down when you get him into the right positions as well absolutely amazing it's just a shame he wasn't central but of course they have to reflect the position he played in when he got the regular card but his shot power is absolutely deadly and is a pleasure to use as well is he worth the coins i would say definitely because he's going to be super super cheap so let's review overall he's lightning quick his finishing is absolutely amazing so clinical that shot power is decent as well amazing dribbling agility as well curve fantastic his passing is absolutely awesome the position change is good news from right ring to left ring and he has such a low price as well due to the fact he's in team of the year packs the things that i don't like about him is his strength he's not the strongest and also his first in form has a better position being central card than this one unfortunately so overall i give him a 9.25 out of 10 if he was a central card he would be getting a lot closer to the 10 score However, that's the review guys, let me know what you think, drop a comment below and if you enjoyed it, leave a like below, comment subscribe and as always, thanks for watching.